Hey, what's up guys? Glock9 here and welcome back to ARK. And as you can see, got a good amount of work done to this base last night. I put in a preservation bin, some more storage, a couple of mortar and pestles down on the floor. Over here, got a workbench and a couple of forges and I put in a bed so we can fast travel now. If you don't know, when you fast travel in this game though, you can't take anything with you. So that makes things a little complicated. One day we'll get a tech transporter or whatever the fuck it is uh, and then you can take things with you but that's gonna be a way off until we unlock tech gear I don't even know how to do that I don't think you can just level up to unlock that stuff I think you have to like beat bosses and shit but not a hundred percent about that now we'll figure it out one day for now I just want to grab some wood and some metal and get some metal smelting down in these forges. And I also want to do a little bit more work to this base. I'd like to get at least the walls upgraded to stone. And then we are going to fast travel back to our first base. And we're going to take Bet Midler to the, uh, the lair of the dragons. And we're going to try and steal ourselves a dragon egg. Because apparently that's how you get a dragon. You just steal one of their eggs and then you incubate it. And you raise it as your own. You can't just tame a dragon. I think I said that in episode two or one or whatever that I wanted to tame a dragon. You don't just tame a dragon. You have to steal the egg, birth it, and then raise it. So hopefully we can manage to pull that off in this episode. go get that fire lit let's get this one lit as well we should go grab some more wood maybe some more metal too then we need to start grabbing stone we got a horse right here now someone told me you have to jump on their back and then you can start taming them by feeding them so let's try that oh I shoved the berry up its ass but I am riding it I just fed it again now what whoops Eat a ride. Okay, how do I do I have to wait till it's hungry again? Yeah, I can't I can't just like feed it, keep feeding it. Damn, less than 3% tame? That's gonna take a while. Shit. Um Alright, fuck it for now. Someone also told me an easier way to get the horses tamed is to um get them in a trap first. You know, so if you're riding it, it really can't run too far. Um so when we're ready to try and get a horse tamed, yeah, fuck you, Corno. That's what you get, coming around here trying to terrorize my little stoner guys. Uh, let's put this into melee damage. So, we'll see. When we're ready to tame a horse, maybe we can get one into that trap over there. Uh, and then, uh, see how long it takes to tame it. The berries didn't seem to be working that good. I think carrots work better. And I know there is a place on Ragnarok where vegetables grow wild and you can get a shit ton of carrots there without having to start a garden. So I just need to find out where that place is and we'll have to make a trip there at some point. Uma, you're chilling here. Put all these levels into help, and let's give her some more fish so she got plenty of food. We don't got to worry about that. Let's get Tom Cruise up on the rooftop. He should be uh, fairly safe up here. I'm gonna set him to neutral, so if anyone fucks with him, he'll fight back. Tom, you're the man of the house now. Hold this place down while I'm gone. All right, got nothing on us. Let's fast travel back to base number one.
All right, here we are. What up, Frank? What up, Jersey? Let's pet our hot dogs. What up, hot dog? All right, you guys got any levels? I think this one does. Yep, yeah, going to help. You guys got a level? No? No? Let's check on our, everyone else. Winona, what up? Nope, no level there. Robert Downey Jr. He's looking good. Ed Norton, no level there. We'll check Bette Midler in a little bit because we are taking Bette Midler for uh, a deadly ride. Who knows if she's going to survive. I'm going to grab our hide armor. We're going to have to make more chitin armor since uh, we left it at uh, base number two. Um, I'm going to take a bow and some arrows. As you can see, and like I said in a previous episode, I did make the shotgun, but I don't want to start using shotgun ammo just yet. Uh, we're going to have to make another canteen because I had to leave my canteen up at the... Uh, second base as well, but for the trip we're going to take now, the water skin should do just fine. Alright, let's go kill some stuff. We need to level up Bette Midler as much as we can and put all of those points into stamina, because when we go and grab one of these dragon eggs, if we're not slick enough and some dragons see us, they're going to chase us and we're going to need a lot of stamina to outrun them. All right, took down the big boy. Had a lot of meat there. And the level, which is what we're after. Let's put that into stamina. We got a level as well. Let's go into fortitude. And we got to keep this murder train moving. I'm trying to get that stamina up to at least 500 before we go and attempt to steal a dragon egg. There we go. Stamina again, of course. Hey, Dodo. Alright, everyone say goodbye to Bat Meddler. This might be the last time you see her. Let's just start heading towards this uh, dragon cave, which is northeast. It's over by the Black Beach. And we'll kill things along the way, try to continue leveling up Bat Meddler's stamina. But we might as well start making our way over there. All right, there's another one. Looking good. Let's get this level spent. 441, not bad. Hopefully we can get that to 500 by the time we make our way to the Black Beach or by the time we're ready to fly into this dragon cave and snatch an egg. I mean, I don't even know if 500 is going to be enough to outrun a dragon. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping it will be, though. I mean, if we're slick enough, maybe we can even get in there and out of there without being spotted. Got a saber tooth right here. Oh, shit. Little army of, uh, what are those, hyenas? Oh, my God. Saber tooth is pissed at me. The hyenas are pissed at the saber tooth. Come on, let me get the kill. Son of a bitch. The hyenas killed it. Oh, there's another saber tooth. Holy shit. Taking a little bit of a beating here. Come on, I want fucking the XP for these kills. Son of a bitch. Those hyenas stole both of my kills. Now we gotta kill the three of them. The little fucks. One dead. Oh, we got a level. That's good. Holy shit, this one's like an alpha. Fucking me up. Oh my god, we're gonna die. Yeah, bitches. Holy shit. I thought I killed you. Oh my god, Bet Midler almost fucking died right there. Are we in the clear? Wow, I had two levels. Put both of them into stamina, of course. We got a level as well. Let's go fortitude again. And let's shove a whole bunch of meat into Bet Midler. Get her health back up. There's a sentence I never thought I would say. Nice, there's another one. Let's go ahead and eat this Triceratops too, even though I'm probably going to drop all the shit. Just eating it for the extra XP. Let's put that point in the stamina, of course. 483, we're almost there. I'm dropping the hide, the keratin, and some of that meat as well. Trying to keep our weight to a minimum. 
All right, there goes the scorpion, and I'm actually gonna hang on to uh, the chitin. One, because it doesn't weigh that much, and two, because we need to make some more chitin armor, because like I was saying, we left uh, the one set of chitin armor we already craft uh, down at our second base. Because I don't think you can fast travel with armor on. I'm pretty sure it will strip you of that. I know you can't have anything in your inventory in terms of having armor on. Not 100%, but I left it there anyway, and we can always make some more chitin armor when we get home. Because I'm sure there'll be plenty of more scorpions to kill, especially on this black beach here. Not only scorpions, but spiders too. All sorts of shit. Uh, what else is here? Uh, I know snakes are here. They don't give us chitin though, but praying mantises do. And I know those are here. Oh shit, that thing broke my armor. Son of a bitch. Probably better off, honestly. The hide armor inside a lava cave, uh, probably not a good idea anyway. Um, that kind of sucks though, now we're naked, but what are you gonna do? I actually want to tame one of these centipedes at some point. I would love to tame a whole bunch of just like the most disgusting, evil sons of bitches in the game, you know? Tame some centipedes. You gotta be able to tame spiders too, right? Just, we should have like an insect army. Fucking centipedes, spiders, scorpions, uh, praying mantises. You know what? I'm just gonna drop this hide armor. Why hold on to the weight? We can craft more. We got plenty of hide back home. Yes. All right, we are getting there. 500. I think we're ready. First, I want to kill this uh, shit beetle over here, though. I mean, like I was saying, the more levels we can get, the better. I just put a number on it, 500. I figured that'd be good. Hopefully. I want to kill this snake. Got a scorpion on the way. Let's see if we can get this snake killed first. There we go. Oh, another scorpion. Let's turn around here. Yeah, two of them. Not a big deal. Oh, here's another snake. And a praying mantis. All right, now it's getting out of control. There, up here, we can hopefully bottleneck them. They can only get to me from one location. We can attack one at a time. Nope, they're all attacking me at the same time. Oh, shit. That praying mantis found a way to get behind me. That's what I was trying to avoid, getting attacked from the front and the back at the same time. Well, we are in a bad situation. They're completely out of stamina. And we're just getting the shit kicked out of us from everyone at the same time. Someone died. Come on. Yes. Fuck you. All right, we got a level. I think we're going to pull this off. Thought we were dead there for a second, man. There was like six of them on us. All right, not bad. Another level. Let's uh, throw that into stamina again, of course. 524. Let's eat some food. Get some of that health back. We got a level as well. I'm gonna throw that into fortitude again. Let me just get somewhere safe. I don't fucking trust it down there. Up here looks good. All right, fortitude. Oh, uh, this is the end of the Black Beach. So the entrance to the cave should be around here somewhere. It looks like right here, actually. Yep, that's it. All right, uh, let's go kill that guy. Fuck it, if we can level up one more time, we might as well try and do it. Oh, this looks like where the cave opens up right here. I wonder if it would be better just to go in this way instead of down through the cave. You know what I mean? Like swoop in on them. I mean, there's a dragon. Right down there. Oh, I don't think it spotted us. There's an egg, though. Look at that. We got an egg right there. Yeah, fuck going in the cave. Let's just swoop down there and grab it. Um, I think I want to try and level up one more time first, though.
Damn, bitch. All right. There we go. 538. That's gonna have to be good enough. All right, I don't see a dragon from this angle, so we're just gonna kind of go in slow here. Hopefully we don't get spotted. I don't want to use any stamina if I don't have to. So far, so good, I think. Get in there, Bet Midler. Give me that egg. All right, dude. Let's get out of here. I don't think we were spotted. Like a goddamn cat burglar. In and out. Oh, man. That's the benefit of being raised in New Jersey. Just makes you a natural-born thief. Let's get into these trees, though. Just in case. I do not think we are being followed. Unbelievable. All that prep work. And we were in and out of there in seconds. I'm going to stick low to the ground, though, just in case. And I'm going to keep flying until our stamina runs out. Just get as far away from this place as possible. Nothing behind us. Well, a scorpion, praying mantis, and a centipede, but nothing to worry about anyway. Get out of here, mantis. Wow, I can't believe we pulled that one off. Let's get up here and get some stamina back. And then we'll make this flight home. Get this egg incubating. Now, there are multiple ways to incubate any egg, really. A dragon egg is going to need a lot of heat. We got a fire dragon at level 90. Sounds good to me. Um, obviously, we, we're not in a position to make air conditioning units. That's one way to do it. And the other two ways are either uh, campfires or standing torches. I'm going to try the standing torch method only because those are cheaper to make than fire pits. And I know I have the materials to make a bunch of those. So that's what we're going to try. Home sweet home. Man, that was fucking sick. I can't believe we pulled that off so smoothly. I didn't think Bette Midler was going to make it out of there. Because to tell you the truth, if the dragons were chasing us and we couldn't get away, uh, my, my backup plan was to just kind of ditch Bette Midler, let the dragons eat her, and then try and make it home on foot, which would have been very hard to do. Uh, but that was my, like, plan B. Luckily, it didn't have to come to that, though. Now, what do we need to make these standing torches? I probably didn't even unlock this recipe yet. I didn't. There we go. Uh, oh, we need flint and stone. All right. Um, let's grab some stone. Flint is in here. And let's make, um, I don't know, let's start with 12. All right, let's get this egg down. Bam, how we looking? Incubating? Oh, no, it's too cold. Shit. All right, well, let's make some more then, I guess. All right, that's four more. Let's get some wood into these torches now. Oh, it's bugging out a little bit. Just got way too many torches around here. There we go. Bam, one more. Whoops. Ah, oh, shit. I picked the egg up. I can't get through there. Let's pick up this torch. Get in here. Drop the egg. There we go. Put some wood into this one. Get it lit. How are we looking now? Uh, shit. I can't get close enough to the egg to see. Oh, there we go. Bam, incubating. All right. That's going to take a while, but we'll let it cook. And when it's done, we'll have a fucking dragon. How cool is that shit? What a great day. Beautiful night. Ending it here on the beach. All right, guys, that's going to be it then. Hopefully, by the start of the next episode, we have a dragon. And then maybe we'll fly the dragon down to our second base. Uh, and kind of get things, uh, continue to build things up down there. Or who knows, maybe we'll start scouting a third base location. But anyway, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you're looking forward to seeing more. Thank you so much for watching and all of the support. It really does mean a lot. You guys can follow me on Instagram or Twitter. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. 
Stick around for more ARK, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.